Hey guys, it's Ben. Moon Animator Suite 2 came out the other day and it added a lot of cool new features including an easy weld and it makes it a lot more simple to rig up guns for animating. So I'm going to do a super quick tutorial on how to rig up guns and animate it. Should look something like this at the end of the tutorial. The first step is obviously to just get some gun models. I'm going to link Mads guns in the description. They're all meshed and look pretty good. So let's just go with a simple model like the UMP. So the first thing you want to do is go to model and insert a part. Now I'm going to put this on the grip of the gun which will be right around here. So let's scale it up and put it there. Now I'm going to name it handle. I'm going to make it invisible. Now select the two parts and group them. Let's name it UMP rig. Go into the model. Now go to plugins, easy weld. Now click handle and then click the UMP. And you're going to go to the easy weld and go to parts, uncheck animatable and click join in place. Now go to the model and explore, click primary part and then click the handle. What this will do is it will set the brick right here to be the main part on the rig for when you're animating. So let's insert my character. Now let's move the gun to a desirable position. Let's put it there. Now you're going to take the UMP rig and drag it into your character model. So mine's right there. So I'm going to go to explore and drag it up into my character. Now go to plugins again and go to easy weld. Go to right arm or whichever arm you have the gun on. Click the arm and then click handle. And then go to easy weld parts and click join in place and make sure animatable is checked. Now open moon animator, click a new animation, click confirm, click the plus, click your character, click OK. Now as you can see the gun is added to your arm and is rigged up. So that's just if it's one gun mesh, but some guns they have multiple different parts on it. For example, the M16, but let's take this real quick. So for this one, all you have to do is click the model, click easy weld, go to cleaner, and then click cleanup tool. What this will do is weld the entire model to one part. However, I would like to animate the magazine. Problem here is that the class name is weld and we actually want it to be motor 6D. Weld basically means that it's just glued together, but motor 6D is what lets us animate in Moon Animator. We're going to get rid of the magazine weld. Go back to easy weld. Click the grip and find the magazine part. Go to parts and click join in place and make sure animatable is checked. And this will make a motor 6D weld. Same concept, insert a character. Now you're going to move it to a desirable position. Now drag your gun model into your character. Go to easy weld, click your arm, click the grip, join in place, make it animatable. Now just do what you regularly do in Open Moon Animator Suite. So you have the gun welded to it. Also we have the, the magazine added as an animatable part. So we can have it come in and out if we please. So real quick I'm going to show you how to add a muzzle flash to the end of the gun. It's pretty simple. So let's just look up muzzle flash on toolbox. That one will do. So you're just going to take this and stick it at the end of the gun. Just put it there. I drag it into the gun model. Same deal. Go to plugins, easy weld, click grip, and then click muzzle flash. I'm gonna join it in place and make it animatable. So as you can see, the muzzle is at the end of the gun. And to have the muzzle flash on and off, what you want to do is click the plus on moon animator. You're going to find the particle emitter for the muzzle flash. I'm gonna click it and click enabled. Click OK. So let's add a frame right here. And let's select the keyframe, click seven. I'm going to click on value and uncheck the value. So this will turn it off. And if you want it to be on, add another keyframe. Click on the keyframe. Now on the easing style, you want it to be on constant out. So what this will do is it won't animate it or progressively turn it on. It'll only turn it on for that keyframe. So off, 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 off. And then right on the frame, it turns back on. And then let's just have it on for two frames. Click plus. 
select it, go to value, uncheck it, off. Let's just pretend there's a gunshot, boom, off. So yeah, that's all you have to do. After that, you just have to animate the gun and whatnot and animate the stance and do all the tricky stuff. Once you know how to weld things in general, then you can have different parts of the gun animatable. Like if you're doing a pistol, you'd want the bolt to be animatable as well as the mag. Just remember to re-weld any parts that you need animatable in easy weld. I hope you enjoyed that and if you guys want a part 2 I might show you guys how to do different effects and like gun smoke and gun shells and whatnot. But if you know the basic techniques you might be able to figure it out. So I hope you guys enjoyed and uh, peace.